Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. Windows 11 is officially rolling out later this year, possibly in October or November. And as many of you know, it is currently available to try out and test in the Windows Insider program, currently in the Dev and Beta channel. And actually yesterday on the 19th of August, Microsoft rolled out Windows 11 build 22,000.160, which is a new preview build over in the Windows Insider program. And with that latest preview build, they've also made the first ISO a file available to download which is an image file of Windows 11 and this is of course if you would like to try out uh, Windows 11 now in a virtual machine or also if you have an extra PC um, where you can create a bootable USB drive and then you can install that ISO image uh, as a fresh install on that PC but obviously that PC needs to meet the minimum hardware and system requirements to be able to run Windows 11 and it's not advisable to install a preview build uh, this ISO image on a working PC because obviously it is still a preview build and will have bugs and glitches. Now the ISO file uh, is Windows 11 inside a preview build 22000.132 which is now available for download and that's over at the Windows Insider preview downloads page. And if we just pop over quickly there, you can see they announced that latest preview build yesterday on the 19th. And here is where the ISOs are now available. And that's preview build 22132. And Windows Insider preview downloads page, you can click on this link to go and download that latest image file. Now just bear in mind that to be able to download the ISO, you need to be part of the Windows Insider program. So if you aren't, you will not be able to download that ISO file. You will have to sign up to the Insider program before you can uh, use this link to download that latest ISO image. And it says here, as you use these ISOs to install Windows 11, you will go through the new Windows 11 setup experience, often referred to as the out-of-box experience or OOBE for short. And it also says here, based on your feedback, we have added the ability to name your PC during the setup experience too. And that's due to recent user feedback in the Insider program. And that's more or less what that new let's name your PC uh, screen will look like when you are installing this uh, latest ISO of Windows 11. And what I'll do is I'll leave uh, a link to this page where uh, you can come download that latest ISO image of Windows 11. So I hope you found this video useful. Once again, thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.